Good morning, and thanks for joining us on FRHS TV. I'm Elena Devlin. And I'm Tim Quinn. Timmy, did you know that both the boys and girls golf team both picked up wins yesterday? Oh, congratulations to them. We'll hear more about that later in our sports segment with Brian. Now let's get to those announcements. Please rise and say the pledge to our flag. Attention seniors, the counselors will be holding the senior class meeting to discuss college and technical slash trade school information, military, and the workforce. The meeting will be held tomorrow during QRT. If you eat A lunch, report to the auditorium during QRT B. If you eat B lunch, report during QRT C. And C lunch, report to the auditorium during QRT A. If you would like a chance to be on the TV game show, Hometown High Q, you can audition this week for your chance. Written round auditions will be held tomorrow, today and tomorrow during QRT in room 215. You only have to come to one of those time slots. If you have any questions, see Mrs. Ladon or Ms. White in room 215. There will be a general membership meeting for anyone wishing to join the Thespian Club after school today in room 119. The club will discuss the fall play, auditions, and other important club news. New members are encouraged to attend. The Writing Lab will be available starting this week. Anyone who would like to help with a writing assignment for any class can attend one of the Writing Lab days. Appointments are only needed if you want a one-on-one -on -one conference with a teacher. This week, the lab is available today in room 221 and on Thursday in room 223. Any junior or senior student with a cumulative weight of GPA of 3.75 or higher should have received an invitation to apply for the National Honor Society. If you have not, you may pick one up with Miss Bruno in room 130. The yearbook staff is looking for photographers to capture events throughout the year. If a photo is used, credit will be given to the photographer and it will be published in the book. Please stop and see Miss Stewart in room 225 if interested. Do you like to sing, but we're not able to schedule for choir? QRT Choir and Men's Ensemble will be practicing after Labor Day. See Miss Newstead in the choir room for more details. Any student who would like extra help with math assignments, there is a math help desk available after school in room 232. This week, the lab is available through Thursday from 2.30 until 3.30. Students signed up for online wellness with Mr. Sill or Mr. Kelly for the fall semester must attend an orientation today in room 213 during QRT A or B. You must attend one of those sessions or you will be removed from the roster. Fashion Club is having their first meeting next Wednesday at 2.30 in Ms. DeSantis' room, 136. In Fashion Club, students learn sewing techniques, create garments, and experiment with materials to create high fashion garments throughout the year. These club members also create holiday-themed fashions for the Telethon Fashion Show, the Art Gala, the Salvation Army's Garbage Bag Gala. Any student interested in joining the National Art Honor Society should see Mrs. Mazina in room 134 for an application. All NAHS applications are due Friday, September 13th by the end of the day. Any senior interested in applying for a class officer position must complete the application process no later than September 18th. Forms are in the office and due back to Ms. Stewart in room 225. If you are interested in joining Student Council, please make sure you pick up an application in room 213. Student Council is looking for participants from each grade level. Forms are due back by Friday, September 6th. Any questions, see, Ms. see Mr. Kreider and Ms. Stewart. The Counseling Center has several college visits each year that send representatives to the high school to meet with interested students about their school. The first college visit is available on September 6th when Notre Dame will be here at 11.30 a.m. If you're interested in attending a college visit, please sign up with Mrs. Courtnage in the Counseling Center. Now, let's take a look at sports with Brian. Thanks, Tim. Congratulations to the boys' golf team who picked up a fourth place finish at the Swickley Invitational yesterday. Michael Wareham took third in the competition with a score of 73. The girls' golf team also had a win yesterday as they beat Indiana 189 to 194. The team is 3 0 overall and 2 0 in their section. In other sports matchups for today, 
The boys golf team will take on Penn Hills today at home at 2.25 p.m. And the girls tennis team will travel to La Trobe for a match at 3.30. Good luck to all of our athletes. Thanks, Brian. And thanks for joining us today, Panthers. Have a great day.